and stand outside the doorway. I stand there and remember Amir. If there was anyone who could reach an agreement and solve the conflict, overcome these historic boundaries, these rifts between the two peoples, it was Amir. This is still my country, and we're not in Switzerland. Danger hangs over our heads all the time. Till that danger ceases to exist, we'll have to do this. Put on our uniforms, some of us for two weeks, some for a month, some for longer than that, and turn into soldiers, just like that, out of the blue. We have to remember that, after all, it's us, the reserves who are here. The people you work with, with whom you go to a restaurant or to a movie. It's not like the minute we put on our uniforms we become a bunch of bloodthirsty savages or something like that. We have to keep in mind that these are IDF soldiers, the guys from the reserves. We're all human beings here. We all lead civilian lives. We just dress differently now on a mission unlike the one we're accustomed to in our everyday life. But beneath it all, we're still human beings. For me, this reserve duty was like a nightmare. A real nightmare. I'm 